subcutaneous injections can be given at a 90 degree or 45 degree angle. Give the injection at a 90 degree angle if you can grasp two inches of skin. If you can only grasp one inch of skin, give the injection at a 45 degree angle. Open the alcohol wipe. Wipe the intended injection site if you have not done so already. Let the injection site dry. Do not touch the site until you've given the injection. Hold the syringe in your dominant hand and remove the cap with your other hand. Place the syringe between your thumb and forefinger. Let the barrel of the syringe rest on your middle finger almost as if you were holding a pencil. Grasp the skin with your other hand and insert the needle into the skin. Hold the syringe barrel tightly and use your wrist to inject the needle into the skin. Gently push down on the plunger. You can inject the medication slowly to reduce the pain of some medications. Leave the needle in for five seconds before removing it. To prevent any leakage. At this point, you can gently wipe the area with a gauze pad or apply a bandage. Do not recap your needle, but place the entire syringe into a sharps container. You can purchase a container or you can make your own from a hard plastic container with a screw top. Make sure to label it appropriately as dangerous and keep out of reach of children and in a safe place. Never throw needles in the trash can. Ask your caregiver or pharmacist regarding state and local requirements for disposing of used syringes and needles. If this is the first time you've punctured your vial, make sure to label it with today's date. You should discard that vial once the medication is gone or after 28 days from the date of first puncture. If your medication is to be refrigerated, remember to place it back within that temperature. As always, please contact us if you have any questions about where to give a subcutaneous injection.